All right, so I've got a lot of friends that have been asking me what the EpiPen looks like when it's used, how to use it, all of those sorts of questions. So I've got an EpiPen and I've got an old muscle milk container here. So let's give it a shot. This is an expired EpiPen that's been sitting around for a while. You can see it's uh, June, I don't know if it'll focus there, June of 2012. It's in and out, but anyways. If you're going to use the EpiPen, what you do is you take the blue cap. We're going to just take it off of the top here. There we go. So now it's loaded and ready to go. And so I'm going to put it right into the cap of this muscle milk container here. Let's take a look at what it looks like when it's done. So there's that. And as you can see, it stabbed right into the muscle milk container. And let's see what the needle looks like afterwards so people know what they're getting into. It actually looks like it might have stayed in there because I don't see needle there. It's a little hard to see, but you can see there's a little uh, perforated hole there as it got through. So let's see what it looks like on the inside here. There's a little area where the epinephrine came out. Is gross and I actually don't see the needle so I think the needle might have retracted back inside of the EpiPen yeah it looks like it retracted back in there so anyways that's how you use the EpiPen and that's what it looks like when it's done So I went back and actually disassembled the EpiPen a little bit after setting it off that first time. And as you can see, there's a spring on the right hand side that helps to push everything in or push the needle down. And then on the left there, you can see I kind of peeled back and uh, I'll try to get it in up close there. But that's the, the needle for the EpiPen. And uh, I've had a lot of people ask, you know, how big is the needle? What does it look like? All that sort of thing. But uh, yeah, that's it. It's not crazy big or anything but when you need it you need it and that's what it looks like